This is the Defiance 3 Custom Brace. To apply the brace to the patient, have the patient seated on a chair and flex their knee to about 30 to 45 degrees of flexion. Have the patient step through the brace and position the condyles so that the center of the hinge is a finger width above the top of the patella. Next, position the thigh and calf cuffs and then secure the anti-migration strap to keep the brace in place. Secure the strap opposite the calf cuff followed by the strap opposite the thigh cuff. If these straps are too long, you can simply trim them with a pair of scissors. Next, loosely thread the posterior thigh strap here and then push the hinges posterior on the knee. Secure the posterior thigh strap, not bringing the center of the hinge beyond midline. Followed by securing the anterior calf strap. For the final strapping procedure, secure the posterior calf strap. Now, note that the center of the hinge is posterior to the midline and a finger width above the top of the patella. It's very important that the brace is applied with this sequence of strapping to ensure the brace functions properly. All straps are marked with a number, 1 through 5, to ensure that they are secured in the correct sequence. The patient needs to understand that they should not retighten any one particularly loose strap. They need to follow the same sequence of strapping used initially to apply the brace. So first, make sure the calf cuff is secure, then secure the thigh cuff. Now retighten the posterior thigh strap, drawing the hinge back. Then retighten the anterior calf strap, being careful not to bring the center of the hinge beyond midline. Resecure the posterior calf strap. Finally, have the patient reapply the brace for you until they feel comfortable putting it on without any assistance. You are now finished fitting for a Don Joy Custom Defiance Brace. Please refer to the fitting instructions included with the brace if further questions arise.